Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and another episode of Skull and Bones Season 1. Thank you to those that joined me on live stream, live chat, and those watching on YouTube after. I would like to thank those that have liked and commented on my videos. I would like to thank those that have subscribed and exploited my channel on other media platforms. Let's get into this episode. Hope you enjoy. Let's get this. Old pirate friend, back in my humble home. Great work. What you did, it was an impossible task for me. I wanted to return to see the Sultana crown, not laid in her tomb. Returning. That dream is gone. I am tired of losing people. All while Vankinko plays Papa over a bunch of weeping Orankaya who are soiling their robes. The DMC don't see it, but they removed the hand that was holding back our blades. We can swing freely and slice their ships into a thousand pieces. I have nothing to fear now. There is nothing else they can take from me. These idiots think if they call me pirate, I'll feel shame. I feel rage. I feel fury. I feel ready. I don't want Rempa anymore. What I want is to see them dead. I remember when we were alone in the Sultana's throne room. She dreamed she had no title, no name to uphold. She wished she had the freedom to be honest. No more lying, Captain. No more of feeling sorry for what we should or could have done. Now, there's only cannons. Shoot, finally, we get to just up and straight fight. The Unbound cannot hope to win the war without an influx of weapons. It's a uh, level nine. It's kind of out of our range, but we'll see what we can do. Soon you'll know the streets of Telok Penjara like I do. A place where no single person controls what happens. When I was in the palace, the merchants were happy. But the DMC sent their most zealous dog. Van Kinko. <laughs> That Dutchman pinches every penny and taxes every pohonier. Of course, he stops my shipments, brands them as contraband. Now, if I want my weapons, I must either beg or take them by force. Pirates like you, however, are free to steal. Oh, yeah. Stealing is an art, and I'm an artist. Stealing beats breaking my back for some lord. <laughs> I didn't realize pirates were interested in art unless it was to steal it. Next time I want to be inspired, I shall come to you. You're a funny guy in pirates. Not long ago, Van Kinko was one of you. But a pardon from the crown of Holland was all it took to obliterate his past. Return my weapons. Let my supporters know Rama trade does not stop for the DMC's whistles. I hope to see you soon. All right, intercept the DMC transport to find where Rama's weapons are being impounded. Sink DMC transporter one. All righty. I don't know how I got stuck on there. She just stopped, but 
let's get to our ship, see what we need to prepare on it before we leave. Repair it. Uh, we got some new stuff. We'll throw into the warehouse. Let's manage the weapons. Cause so far right now we got all fours. We're gonna need, well, besides this one, which is a one. But we need to start upgrading our weapons and all that. Flooding Demi Cannon. The range is just small though. But usually we just um, get up and personal anyway. Fire long range. We got the Zama 2s. It just brings the range shorter though. The waves and winds dance for you. We got this long gun too, but the reload is slow. Damage is way higher than what we have. And this one's good too because it's the flooding damage. Crazy part says 105 at the top. And this says 95 but the damage is huge. But the reload is way bigger. I think we're gonna have to stay with what we got for now. Only a kingpin's daring adventures for you. So we'll put the flooding ones in. The front. We don't have anything better for Mons Meg. We need those for uh, bombards and nothing good for auxiliary. All right. Let's find out where we gotta go for this. Where we gotta sink them from. Way down here. There's a fast travel right here. Right chat? Um The hardest part is getting those uh drill tips. Those drills were we need those so we could get uh better cannons. Set sail. I'm gonna have to try to uh, like join other people and try to get those things then somehow all right we're going the right way oh wait am I going through a little creek thing Yeah, I'm dumb. I'm trying to go through this thing. I'm sorry, chat. Use your spy gun to find a shipment of weapons, Captain. 
Alright, we'll stop right here. Like she said, use this. Yeah, that's the only one. It's that small one, and... See? Alright, that's not that bad. Alright, let's go after him. Oh, that's short range, for sure. Trying to aim for the weak spot right there. Ooh, get away from that. Too low. We could turn around and uh, sink them with the uh, flooding damage. All right, full speed right into them. They call for reinforcements or no? Oh, well, they are now. There. That one's running. Gonna go after it. But there's the thing about the short range. That's the only drawback, guys, from switching it. We gotta wait until it turns yellow, I think. Yep, yellow right there. I think there's a ship thing right here. Is that... We didn't pick up the stuff for it then, huh? Alright, let's go get it then. Got another ship right here that we could sink. into it get more damage right. slow it down to another way V kinkle scheme to learn about Rama's contraband weapons Ah, oh, I totally forgot. Where am I going? Oh yeah, I'm at full blast, but freaking these things. 
get out of here. Totally forgot about those outposts. I think I'm out of the range now. Alright, let's uh read this contraband stuff. Kinko scheme and then a treasure map. The storage is full at the Necrolopus from the recent acquisitions of weapon stockpiles. Perhaps we could sell the crate back to the Rumpa. Fetch a hefty sum. The look on their faces when they have to buy their own weapons would be priceless. General Van Kinkle. So it's at Necropolis. Oh, them. That's what they were talking about. Yep, we'll get away from them. So, Necropolis. We were just there. Alright, let's go. Those guys were eyeing us. Do you have anything we want? Screw mechanism. We have enough screw mechanisms now. We needed those for a while. But now we just need those drill bits. And too bad, like these things, like the ships don't carry them. You have to, you have to raid them or plunder them from um, that one city. Which was, we had to in the last episode, and all those war bases, the fortresses, but they're hard, just as hard. Yeah, I don't know why he's still doing that chat. We discovered it in that one episode. <coughs> Let's uh, discover it and then go to Necropolis. Oh yeah, this is still a beautiful game chat. I love it, but I don't know why. Uh, I try to stay away from the negativity of some people. Yeah, the West Foundry. I remember that one. But let's turn left. Get through here and then uh, get to Necropolis. Was it chat? No, it was over here chat. This one. That's the one with the drill bits and stuff. We had a... We, uh... Needed help with in last episode. Oh yeah, we... Let's grab the shipwreck, because... Wow, we're going way too fast. For us open. Yeah, we need a uh, money chat. Build it up a little. <clears throat> now let's head on over again. <clears throat> Fine. Search the area. These guys. We have to fight again. Go, 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 go. <laughs> I don't know why I was sitting still.
Get these little guys out of here too. I think it's also the the towers are here too. That's why we're going down pretty good. Oh, we're going down. I know, chat. We are. Because we're st very low. We should. We need to do the sinking stuff. <clears throat> the hard part is we don't have that much turnaround. I'm gonna have to do some hard turnarounds, but then those uh, towers, though. Everyone is looking at you these days. The stories of your heroics enthrall the masses. Yeah, um, I didn't realize my mic was off. I guess I accidentally hit it, but, uh, earlier we went around after we got sunk. We went around the guys, grabbed our, uh, loot. Took a little a route around those islands to get rid of them. We sunk like two more ships. And then we went into that little cove and got into there and disembarked. And that's when we got the uh, contraband weapons. And then found out we could fast travel. And I took that because I was trying to explain when I realized my mic was off. That... Um, it would be easier to fast travel because once we set sail, 
all those ships around the island would be right after us and they're very powerful so all right let's submit i'm not familiar with gratitude but i assume this strange sensation i have now is that baby thing my officers will have a drink on your behalf tonight i pay they bet you'd return. I bet you'd sink. <laughs> Excuse our little game. I lost a few coins, but I won a valuable lesson. You're either as remarkable as they say, or Van Kinkle is losing his touch. Fine, I'll admit it. You might just be the villain we were looking for all along. The shipment you collected was only branded contraband because the DMC didn't profit from it. Those weapons mean power to me and a small fortune to you. But I know the DMC. They will not surrender this route so easily. And I won't tire of the sight of cannonballs, so keep them coming, Captain. Another level on Kingpin. Another smuggler's mark. I was just confused on that too, chat in the beginning. Like this whole little game thing like before it, she said that. Under a storm is the next contract. Steal the termites to increase Rama's arsenal. Medium ship size ship required, which what we have. And it's a level 8, so it should be a little bit easier. Look at As it happens, we are not the only ones the DMC take advantage of. They killed Chinese merchants who came to sell their new invention. One way to strike a deal. Van Kinkle intends to use it to turn every pirate into ashes. He's even boasting about his plans. Except the dead tricked him. Their cargo was hidden. Van Kinkle and the DMC know where to find it. But we can find it faster. We should kill Van Kinkle before he kills us. We must obtain this object he desires so much. Uh, we should kill him, but... She was talking about taking it before he does. Let's kill Van Kinkle. Oh, we will. But first we must take from him everything he holds dear. I want him to hope and then to fear. The Unbound have sailed already. They will hold the DMC off until you arrive there and steal it from under their noses. I am not lost anymore, Captain. They want to call me a pirate, a rebel, a threat to the Empire. I will inspire them to call me worse. Under a storm. Don't overlook the Lopenjarans. Our stories capture the whole world. She just confuses me with her, I'm calm, then freaking I'm gonna, I'm mad. Oh, I don't understand that chat. Oh, the in-game chat room? So if I go to it right now? Wait. Like, where's the translation? Interface setting Group text scaling like Shows me his profile But where is the translation of what they're saying because it looks like there's speak uh, 
that's um German. And they're talking about Skurlock, so they're probably doing a Skurlock uh thing. But we got mail too because we made uh Kingpin a couple times. So let's uh grab that mail real quick. Usually they give you like a a cannon. That's what I've been getting lately. Check our cargo. Oh, it gave us a furniture this time. Oh, that was from something else then. Here's the chest. Rocket 3. I wish we have Rocket 2 on. That's going to help out a lot. And I've noticed we haven't been using that during our battles. Much like us pirates, Admiral Rama battles for freedom. And understand the strength and respect. Man, this ship. we got to get that on. It's auxiliary chat. This weapon Rama mentioned sounds powerful indeed. I'd feel a lot better if we kept it out of the wrong hands. So we got the rocket Only threes now. Daring adventures for you. Oh yeah, we just gotta keep uh, leveling up. But we gotta do missions to do that. Then hopefully we might get those uh, fours and stuff. Alright, where do we gotta go now? Down south again. Sink a scavenger again. Alright, let's go. Get back onto the waters. Oh yeah, we gotta use that now. Because that would have helped us out a lot. <clears throat> Besides just sinking. Using the sinking stuff. Or flooding, I mean. That might be them there. Oh yeah, that's them. Alright. We're going to ram right into that first. Use this at the same time. yet Oh, that little ship had those? Wow. Right, there's a dude there. Alright, retrieve termites from the delivery crate. Kelevar chamber to deny the DMC its firepower. Okay, how far is it? It's pretty far, so... Let's go back to... Here, and then we'll... 
fast travel to it. But we're gonna stay away from that, uh, rogue pirates, I think. For now. Because we can't disembark or anything when we're under combat. And those uh, rogue pirates love to just start fighting. Right. Fast travel. Delivery crate. Under a storm, submit. 500 rockets, nice. Equip the termite on our ship. Oh, that's gonna be cool. And we just got that, uh... The level 3, uh, one. And we just put it on, too. Auxiliary. Termite is... Wow, it's worse. Why do they want to? It's worse than the two. But what does the termite one do? Like, it gives us fire and all that stuff. And we got to destroy a tower with the termite. And we got to plunder. Only a kingpin's daring adventures for you. And you are a three plus and then number eight. Oh, that's not bad then. If it's a number eight, do we have time chat? I was just seeing if we had time chat. Sorry. Um, we'll fast travel over there real quick if we have a spot. No, we don't. All right, sorry, chat. Um, the docks and taverns ring with word of your deeds. The plunder would take too long. Like we would have to go over there, uh, sail, and then plunder it. It would take over our time. So, um, thank you guys on live stream live chat for joining me and those on youtube watching later all right guys we'll see you in the next episode have a blessed day